this is our pug mill. This is what it's called in construction industry. It's basically used to take dry material and add water to it so it'll compact a lot better. If the, if the material is damp, it'll compact twice as fast and twice as hard when it dries. Our Region F Solid Waste District had money for stuff like this, and, and this, that's a, a group that's trying to keep stuff going in the landfills. Uh, tires is one of the biggest problems they were having. Uh, it was just something that was piling up, people were trying to find things to do with it, and we thought, you know, we have the, we have the tools to, to be able to try to use it on the road. What we started doing was, uh, you know, there's a lot of ground up rubber around, and we thought we have the same size material that we do chip and seal with, which is uh, laying a coat of asphalt on the road that goes down into cracks, and then you cover that with a rock. Well, we've incorporated 20% of that is rubber from manufactured tire, you know, ground up tires. Between those two together, we've done several roads around here. It's made it a better, a better road. It actually is about 10% quieter. That's kind of crazy to say that, but it actually is. So far, it's, it's worked five years. We've had it and done five-year projects so far, and it's lasting better than the normal chip and seal does. Every ton that we use here is 100 tires. It's the equivalent of 100 tires is what it is. I had 21 ton we went through here last year. So that's, you know, that's quite a few tires in, in our county. Uh, I'm not trying to be the leader county for anything, but I've talked to eight different counties. They're all interested. They've all come look at what we've done. That might be able to pull up the percentage a lot more and use a lot more rubber. I've been in road construction for 50 years. I knew, I've been around every road building way, so that's why I gave my time back to our county here by running for this to help improve our roads. We're doing a service to our county and having other counties watch us. We've got almost 900 miles of road in this county and anything we can do to make something a little cheaper or a little safer, then that's what I would like to try. This video was funded through a grant provided by the Missouri Department of Natural Resources.